Hi, I'm Donna Barnes, author of Giving Up Junk Food Relationships. And in this clip, I'm going to talk about how to stop sabotaging your relationships. Because unfortunately, far too many of us suffer with anxiety or fear on some level. Whether it's fear of commitment, fear of intimacy, fear of rejection, fear of abandonment, it's fear that I believe ruins all relationships. So the best thing that you can do for yourself is when you start feeling that panic and that insecurity where, quite frankly, you want to control your partner. And it's such a scary thing that when you can't, when you can't control what they're doing and you want to and you try, you're destroying your relationship. So the best little tool for you is when you start feeling that way, you start panicking and you want to yell at your partner and you want to cry or, or whatever it is, push the pause button. Just stop and take some long, deep breaths. Breathe in to the count of eight and out to the count of four. It's a cognitive behavioral therapy technique. It is impossible to feel anxiety when you're breathing deep. And here's the other thing, the emotional response center of the brain is the first one to kick in. So we start to panic and we feel all those feelings and the more thoughtful, rational part of our brain takes a few more minutes to kick in. So that's why when you're in an argument, you're told to just wait a few beats before you respond. You know, I never got that until I learned that by waiting those few beats, my brain is gonna be more capable of responding, then yeah, I'll wait those few beats. So be really aware of that. When you start to catch yourself feeling really anxious or insecure or emotional, or you're actually panicking, I think that's what a real panic attack is, where you have that anxiety that you're reaching out to that person and you need to communicate with them. Stop. You're gonna do damage to your relationship. Push that pause button. Take some long, deep breaths. And if you're not in their company and you're trying to communicate something to them, write it down. Absolutely write it down with your hand, in, with a pen on paper. Your brain will process the information better than just typing on a keyboard. So write it down, but do not communicate it to them until you've had a chance to calm down. Because far too many people sabotage the relationships in a moment of insecurity or panic and anxiety. It's really anxiety that's causing you to feel those things. So if you can recognize that and just stop, do nothing. Don't send a text, don't send an email, don't make a phone call, just stop. And if you're in their company, then maybe just try to take a deep breath and say, I'm sorry, I need to go calm down and go take a walk if you need to. It'll, it'll really help. So try not to act on your anxieties and your insecurities. Push the pause button, take some deep breaths, and allow that more rational part of your brain some time to kick in and then listen to it. I'm Donna Barnes, the author of Giving Up Junk Food Relationships.